In the fascinating world of exotic pets, a new buzz is building around a creature both tiny and mighty, the Mesor Kefalotes, or giant African harvester ant. Are they simply a fleeting trend, or is there a deeper value to keeping these intricate insects? And what about the whispers of big money in the ant-keeping community? From the arid grasslands and savannas of East Africa, a region encompassing the diverse landscapes of Kenya, Tanzania, and Ethiopia, the Mesor Kefalotes is making its presence known in the world of formiculture, the dedicated keeping of ants. For enthusiasts like Anna, it's more than just a novelty. There's something truly captivating about watching them. It's like having a miniature, perfectly organized society right here. But it's not just about the cool factor, there's a real responsibility that comes with caring for these amazing creatures. The allure of Mesocephalotes often starts with their impressive size, especially the major workers with their powerful reddish heads. And yes, in certain circles, established colonies can fetch a significant price. But to focus solely on the monetary value misses the real fascination. These aren't just commodities, they're complex biological marvels. In their native East Africa, they play a crucial ecological role, diligently harvesting and storing seeds, aerating the soil with their intricate tunnel systems. By observing them in a 3D rendered formicarium, we gain a unique window into these natural behaviors, a direct connection to the ecosystems of Kenya and beyond. Keeping Mesocephalotes responsibly means understanding and replicating their natural environment as closely as possible. This involves providing the right 3D rendered substrate, mimicking the sandy soils of their East African homes, maintaining appropriate 3D simulated temperature and humidity levels, and offering a varied diet of realistic 3D rendered seeds similar to what they would forage in the wild. It's a long-term commitment that requires research, patience, and a genuine dedication to their well-being. It's not as simple as just putting ants in a box. You need to understand their needs, their natural behaviors. It's about creating a thriving habitat for them. A little slice of Africa right here. The allure of big money in the exotic pet trade can sometimes overshadow crucial ethical considerations. It's vital to emphasize the importance of responsible sourcing. Wild-caught specimens can disrupt fragile ecosystems in East Africa, and illegal trafficking poses a significant threat. As keepers, our responsibility lies in supporting ethical breeders and ensuring the long-term sustainability of this hobby, respecting their origins in places like Kenya and Tanzania. I've learned so much just by watching them. Their efficiency, their teamwork, it's truly inspiring. It makes you appreciate the incredible diversity of life on our planet, even in the smallest of creatures from places like Kenya. Beyond the economic aspect, keeping Messer Kefalotes offers a unique educational opportunity. Observing their complex social dynamics, their problem-solving skills, and their intricate communication methods provides a tangible lesson in biology, ecology, and even social structures. It's a chance to witness evolution in miniature, right before your eyes. The passion for formiculture extends beyond individual keepers. A vibrant community exists, sharing knowledge, best practices, and a mutual respect for these fascinating insects. This collective enthusiasm fosters responsible keeping and contributes to a deeper understanding of ant biology. So, are Messer Kefalotes ants worth big money as pets? Perhaps in a transactional sense, but their true value lies far beyond mere monetary worth. It's in the unique window they offer into a complex world, the lessons in responsibility and observation they impart, and the connection they provide to the incredible biodiversity of East Africa, right here in our homes. Intrigued by these tiny titans from Africa? Subscribe, like, share, and leave your comments below. Share your thoughts on the real value of keeping Messer Kefalotes and join the ant-keeping community.